Thankfully, it's November, and Appalachian Wireless is offering the Samsung GS8 or the GS8 Plus for $100 off the regular price with two-year agreement. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Wednesday night, just before 10 p.m., a state trooper stopped a vehicle in the Warfield community for suspected DUI. But when the driver got out of the vehicle, Martin County deputies discovered drugs inside. I noticed a syringe laying in the driver's seat in plain view. Um, at that time, I asked the driver if he had anything in the vehicle. And he, at that time, he said there was a quantity of marijuana inside his vehicle. That discovery led to a more thorough search. Well, around 58 grams of methamphetamine was found underneath the passenger seat of the vehicle. $12,640 was, was found um, on the driver and inside the vehicle. But in the midst of these discoveries, deputies realized the situation was more severe than they first thought. The driver of the vehicle uh, started complaining of chest pains, sweating uh, very badly. He was transported to Poppy Hall of a possible drug overdose. And then the passenger of the vehicle was transported as well as an overdose. Um, she was actually narcan on scene by net care ambulance service twice. The driver, 34-year-old Billy Williams of Nicholasville and his passenger, 25-year-old Mary Parsons of Beauty, both remain in critical condition. They have been charged with felony trafficking in methamphetamine, trafficking in marijuana, and possession of drug paraphernalia. A passenger in the vehicle, 32-year-old Hagen Johnson of Lexington, was arrested and also charged with trafficking in meth and marijuana. He also had warrants out of Fayette County for the same charges. Deputy Blevin says 114 grams of meth was seized with a street value of approximately $10,000. So this was coming in. It was going somewhere to be distributed out. Um, we will find out where it was going. Uh, hopefully there will be more arrests made over this incident. In Inez, I'm Shannon Deskins, EKB News.